we've just tapped the lovely black walnut so we can convert basically its lifeblood into a delicious syrup. But why do these trees have this liquid in the, the living tissue underneath the bark? This is how the trees transfer nutrients up and down. When the leaves are out, they're sending energy down into the root systems. This time of year, it's reversed. We're getting closer to spring, so the roots are starting to send their energy back up towards the top of the tree because in another couple of months, all of the little leaf buds that are way out there on the ends of the twigs will start swelling with this sap and start the next generation of photosynthesis. Sap flow is driven by the changes in season. The pressure in the roots is greater than the pressure in the crown of the tree, so the sap flows up. Tree sap averages about 98% water, so it takes almost 40 gallons of sap to make one gallon of syrup. Ta-da! I think it's on there! Yay! <laughs> Ooh, yeah.